Now look at this. If you have to solve it and if you don't use proportion, first you have to square it, okay, to remove the square root and then you have to square it further, right? So we use componendo dividendo. So componendo dividendo, well this is root 3x plus 7 plus root over 3x, numerator plus the denominator here also numerator minus the denominator I have not used the bracket again but you are supposed to use the bracket otherwise you make a mistake now I said it's both sides now here the right hand side there is no denominator so when there is no denominator it's understood the denominator is 1 so plus 1 7 plus 1 7 minus 1 so this cancels and now square both sides and then do the cross multiplication So first, using the property, I did one, two type sums. Here is another type, solving, and I go into the another sum. So there is another type proving. Now before I proceed, we will start with this. Uh, sorry, this is equal to something has to be there. I think this is if x is equal to this. Okay. Now you will apply componendo dividendo. Now look at this. You will get this plus this. So twice root a plus 3b by twice root a minus 3b here okay in all the sum it comes like this but that doesn't mean you come from here to here you will lose marks okay as you go on practicing you will find in all the sums you get twice the numerator by twice the denominator applying component of dividend so why to waste so much of time so straight away you write twice the numerator by twice the denominator so waste of time, waste of marks as well, right? So you will not do that. You will 
apply component of dividend of properly and then proceed further. So we'll start with this. So by component and dividend. Of. So what is component and dividend? Of? Numerator plus denominator by numerator minus denominator. So here there is no denominator. So since there is no denominator, denominator is 1. So this is x plus 1 by x minus 1. Apply it. I am doing it again for you, the full thing. This change of sign is very important, be careful. So use a bracket. So don't do that. So this cancels, this cancels. I said you will get twice of this by twice of the denominator. So you, as you practice the sums, it will come to this in all the sums. So you straight away jump into the conclusion, it will be always this. So why doing so much? We write state where this, you lose marks. So do this. This step is important. You will find in your question, omission of essential steps will result into loss of marks. And this is one of the essential steps, so you must do it. Now squaring both sides again. Well, at this stage, there are two ways of, you have two options. One to expand it and do the cross multiplication. So when you expand it, you will have three terms here. Multiplying with the two terms here will be six terms altogether. You may go wrong anyway. I'm again applying component or dividend to make it simpler, okay? So applied component of dividend again. Now here, why I said it, this formula you must have done in class 8. If not, please make a note, will come handy. So these are the two identities which you must have done in class 8. You can just learn it. So it is a plus b whole square plus a minus b whole square is twice a square plus b square. So this is it. And this is 4ab. So this is it. This cancels. This cancels. You get 2a by 6b. Okay. So this is 2. This is 3. So what you get? 3 in 3b into x square plus 1 is equal to 2ax. So this is what you have to prove. 3bx square 
माइनस टू ए एक्स प्लस थ्री बी इक्वल टू जीरो सो दिस इज अनदर टाइप सो दिज आर दी टाइप्स ऑफ सम्स विच आर डेट आर बेसिकली विच यू हैव टू डू फॉर दिस चैप्टर सो आई डू वन और टू मोर टाइम परमिट्स I did a sum like this, the second sum. Okay, always to start from what is given. So this is x square plus 2x plus 2x plus 4 by x square plus 2x 